26th of November 2023, the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant in Ukraine experienced a disruption in its main off-site power connection, forcing it to rely on backup electricity for reactor cooling. This incident underscores the precarious state of nuclear safety and security at the facility amidst the ongoing military conflict, as stated by IAEA's Director General Rafael Mariano Grossi. Simultaneously, the International Atomic Energy Agency experts present at the power plant reported hearing several rockets, apparently launched in close proximity to the plant. Although cloud cover obscured the visibility of the projectiles, the distinctive sound suggested they were fired from a nearby multiple launch rocket system. Grossi emphasized the vulnerability of the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant, situated on the front line of the conflict, and expressed ongoing concern about both the susceptibility of its off-site power supplies to distant attacks and the direct military risks it faces. He highlighted the special source of concern arising from the apparent rocket firing near the plant. The nuclear power plant attributed the power loss to a short circuit approximately 100 kilometers north of the plant, resulting in the disconnection of its remaining 750 kilovolt power line, the last of the four in existence before the conflict. The plant currently receives external power from its sole available 330 kilovolt backup line. Following the power loss, one emergency diesel generator initiated operation to supply reactor unit 4, indicating a potential issue with its electrical configuration. The generator was manually shut down after 10 minutes. While the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant is working on repairing the 750 kV line, the timeline for its reconnection remains unclear. This incident adds to a series of external power supply disruptions during the conflict, necessitating the use of emergency diesel generators for crucial nuclear safety and security functions, including reactor cooling. The 750 kV line had previously experienced a disconnection and reconnection twice on August 10th.